Hey guys, so as you can see, I just landed at Thessaloniki. My dad picked me up and uh, he's just calling my uncle who is playing taxi today. And then we are apparently are going to see the waterfalls in Edessa, where I haven't been yet, uh, surprisingly. Um, yeah. Yay! I actually just want to go to bed. Okay. Museum, that's the Archeologico Museo Palace, that's the archaeological uh, museum in pa uh, Palace. And it's small, but it was really great, and um, I really enjoyed it. We finally managed to get to the waterfall, so it's extremely loud here, but it looks nice. almost asleep um, but I'm finally here and I finally arrived in Veria and I'm actually super happy I miss this view I seriously miss this we went we went to the hot springs in Lutraki we didn't see them yet they're downstairs but it's pretty it's pretty pretty here I like it I have to say, it's really, really pretty here. And there's another waterfall where you can even go into and be near it. Probably really interesting. And down there, there's like, I think it's a hot spring or something. At least it looks like it's hot. And there, the waterfall continues over there. sunny weather we went to uh, the beach today so actually I went to the pool already but uh, um, now we are at the beach I'm really excited because I haven't been on the beach yet but this is an organized beach like it has a blue flag so uh, apparently it's really really good you can see here's everything you need you can you can even uh, uh, get dressed here and umbrellas and harder cut deck chairs I think and this guy in the front with the blue shirt that's my dad and in front of him you can't see him yet that's my grandpa but the beach oh the water is beautiful I can't wait to hop in I'm dead. I'm actually dead. Um, we were in the water like an hour, I think around maybe an hour. Uh, it was great. The water wasn't as cold as I thought it would be. It was actually warmer than the water in the pool. Um, we had fun and I want to go to sleep now. <laughs> oh well. First to eat something, then to cover something. <laughs> yeah, so uh, my dad just said that uh, first we go eat something and then probably bubble, like talk about something. Maybe we can play a, a card game or something. We are going to go Okay. So, um, if your grandfather has bees in his behind. <laughs> So uh, my grandfather is with them and um, my dad, my grandfather and my aunt just came for one day because my mom is still in uh, Veria 
and my grandfather can be a little impatient sometimes, like all the time. So probably yes, they, he's in his behind. Yes. Yeah, that's a German saying uh, that someone has a beast in uh, uh, <laughs> their behind. I actually don't know the English equivalent to that, but okay. So we'll see. My dad and I are going to visit a cave and to get to the cave, hi dad, uh, we have to drive with this cute little train thingy. This, I'm excited about this, this is so cute. right now and I have to tell you the truth this cat is the most interesting thing here right now this and its brothers and sisters but I can't see them from here look how cute it is god I love kitties so cute so guys we were in the cave but we weren't allowed to film or make photographs and now we are in the museum it's small but it's nice there are everything or at least many things they found in the cave And this is the this is the cast of the apparently first human um, skull that was ever found. And as you have seen, this huge thing there, that that's a replica of the um, place. Where they found the skull? One second. There, you can see it. That is the place where they apparently found it. It's really interesting. Whoever goes to um, Greece should uh, go to Petralon and, and uh, you can see it there. And um, go to the cave. It was really interesting.